of my crafty YouTube friends. I have a new project that I am gonna be working on this month. If you're following along on my Instagram or if you read my blog newsletter, you probably already know what I'm doing. But I'm gonna be creating what is called a phenology wheel. And um, what it is, it's going to be a year long project where we stitch something each month on this kind of like a pie chart and it will go in a 10 inch embroidery hoop at the end of the year. Um, and we're going to be, hopefully my vision is that um, we will all stitch along together and um, those who want to share pictures of their progress can do so on Instagram using hashtag cutesycraftssal. So that will be cutesycraftsstitchalong. If you don't have an Instagram, don't worry about it. I'm gonna be sending out updates every month in my newsletter, uh, my email newsletter, and I'll also be recording a video every month to show you the progress that I am making on my phenology wheel. But I just thought it'd be something fun to do as like a big group together. I've already um, sold a bunch of the fabric. You don't have to buy the fabric. You, I'm gonna also provide a free download for the PDF. I just feel like doing it this way is a little bit easier because all the lines on it will have to be straight and everything like that. Um, but you can always just get a piece of fabric and trace the pattern that I'm gonna be giving out. I'll also be giving out patterns for the different things that I observe in nature. Um, but just keep in mind that those will be local for like California where I am, but some of them might be um, plants that are native to your area as well. So you'd be able to use my patterns. Um, you're gonna also want to print out the pattern either way if you buy the fabric or not. That way you can sketch and design your patterns on the paper before transferring them. At least that's how I would wanna do it. So here is the fabric that I designed for the phenology wheel. As you can see, there is a little spot for each month. And what we're gonna be doing is, it's like so for January, for example, we're gonna be embroidering uh, something that I observe around me in nature for the month of January. Um, I'll design it and then embroider it in that spot. So I'll just show you a couple of the ones that I designed, I got a little bit ahead of the game because I feel like I have to if you guys are gonna be stitching along with me. So the first one here, I'm not sure if it's gonna go in January or February. Um, I think it might like it better in January with the colors. But anyway, um, this is warm wood. And then I have another one here that is a dwarf strawberry tree. And then I'm also started working on this um, California poppy. And if you're not artistic and you still wanna follow along, you can look up pictures on the internet of the things that you want to embroider. Um, you're not gonna be selling it, so if you find some inspiration from a photo or a drawing online that you wanna use for your own personal phenology will of whatever plants are in your area, that's totally, I think, something that is fine to do also. So this is just gonna be video one and hopefully a series of videos that I will be doing all year long to show you my progress on the phenology wheel. Make sure to head over to Instagram and follow along with hashtag cutesycraftssal. And I'm hoping that we could use that hashtag for like future stitch alongs too, because I think that this is gonna be really fun and I'm excited to stitch along with you. So um, I'll leave a link in the description for where you can purchase the fabric and um, where you can sign up for my newsletter if you want updates on that um, for when I post the blog post. Um, it's not up quite yet um, as of posting this video, it might be. So check down in the description to see if I've got the blog post up with the pattern for you to print out. But I'll definitely have the link for purchasing the fabric. And also it doesn't have to be January to start. You can start this anytime or work on it anytime you want. Don't have to feel pressured to like finish it at any given moment. So I hope you guys will do that with me. Um, let me know if you have any questions about the project itself. I'll be happy to answer those. Have a great week guys.